my name is Laura Perez-Reyes. I'm your Cameron County District Clerk. I was elected in 2020. Prior to serving as your district clerk, I sat on the school board of the Brownsville ISD. I was elected to do that in 2016, and I successfully completed my term in 2020. I attended Clearwater Elementary, I attended Central Middle School, and I graduated high school. I attended high school and Pace, Pace High School. I attended during, I mean, I'm all BISD. I remember my teachers, you know, um, as you know, or as you may remember, Clearwater is situated right next to Central. So I started in Clearwater, right? I went to Clearwater. And when I moved on to, I had wonderful teachers, of course, and whenever I moved on to middle school, in the mornings prior to coming to school, I would stop by and I would visit all of my favorite teachers. You know, it's something, it's something I did. And even later when I graduated high school, um, I went back to look. I didn't find them, but I did try to go back and, and find my, my third grade teacher, um, Ms. Martinez, my fifth grade teacher, Ms. Garcia, over at Clearwater. Unfortunately, I could not locate them, but I did want to invite them to my graduation. With my educators, well, they were very supportive. They were very supportive. I think that um, they were tough when they needed to be. Um, they always I took so many AP classes, you know. Um, it really helped me. I graduated um, college. I earned my bachelor's degree in about three years because of, you know, BISD, the uh, dual enrollment programs. Um, I had my composition one, composition two, and so my relationship with my teachers were always, was always a very positive one. And whenever I needed to be redirected, um, they did that for me. So it really helped me transition into college and, and be successful, you know, to just have, I didn't have such a difficult time because of my AP teachers. You know, they were so strict, it really helped shape me, prepare me for, for college. I'm very proud to be a product of BISD. Um, as a mother now, you know, that is, BISD is what I choose for my kids. I have my two boys, uh, seven and nine, they're students at Hudson. Um, I'm very thankful, you know, um, to my teachers. I'm very thankful for, for their support. Um, I'm very thankful for the environment that they provided. I'm very grateful. Even now, looking back, I'm, I'm grateful. And now visiting still because, you know, even though I'm no longer on the school board, I can still, I still am invited to come by campuses and, and be um, a partner and, you know, in, in, a, in education. Would recommend BISD to new parents. I think that uh, BISD as opposed to charter schools or any other school, um, I think that BISD is just this world of endless opportunities. It helps you develop so many different talents, whether it be, you know, being part of a running club, being uh, in a coding program, being in a estudiantina, being in, in a, a soccer. Um, I know my kids' school, they have, they have the piano and they have, um, you know, so many different instruments. They have chess and, uh, it affords you all those opportunities. Excellent uh, special services as well, you know, for some of our kids. I know my kids are in the dyslexia program and um, I know that I can count on BISD to, to provide those services. Really grateful for the service that BISD provides. Educators, our cafeteria, transportation, um, our coaches. I think that so many students find the support in school that they don't have at home, you know, so. Um, I'm very grateful, I feel indebted, I feel um, just very, very proud of BISD, public, in, uh, public education in general. For me, very great experiences, but uh, what I see now is, is mostly gratitude for the service that students receive.